Hi guys, what's up? Rockstar Gaming Fan 95 here, back with another video, and today's going to be my Blu-ray DVD collection for 2022, and the music section. But before I start, I do have one military movie in my collection, which I will show off first. So here we go. So first up, the only military film I got is the Hunt for Red October from 19... Does it say? Does it say? I don't think it does. Nineteen eighty nine. Uh, Nineteen eighty nine classic with Sean Connery and Alec Baldwin, the first Jack Ryan film. So there you go. That's the military movie. So let's get into the musicals. So first musical we have. Uh, we have Annie Get Your Gun from 1950. Really enjoyed this movie a lot with Howard Keel and Betty Hutton. Great movie about Annie Oakley. Next we have the classic Bugsy Malone from 1967. Or 76, sorry. Um, yeah, I like this film a lot with uh, Scott Baio and Jodie Foster. One of my uncle's favourite movies. Next we have Calamity Jane from 1950, really enjoyed this movie a lot with Doris Day and Harry Keel, one of the first movies that my mum introduced me to my musicals, uh, she loved it when she was young, along with my nana Pam, both her and my nan were big on their musicals, so yeah, really enjoyed that movie with lovely Doris Day, may she rest in peace now Doris, because she sadly died last year, she would have been 100 this year, or Next we have Clam, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, of course with Dick Van Dyke, who's still going strong. Uh, Sally Ann House, um, sadly passed away last year. And uh, Lionel Jeffries. Next we have Dirty Dancing, uh, classic of course from uh, 1987. With... Uh, Jennifer Grey and Patrick Swayze, great film. Next we have Grease, a classic of course, from uh, 1977 with uh, John Travolta and Olivia Newton-John. Also the sequel, and I don't tend to. Next we have Mamma Mia, great film from 2008. Um, little short story about this, um, when I was young, I went to the cinema with my uh, my mum and my auntie, and they were watching this. And my movie, well, I was watching. Um, I went to go and see the disaster movie, but disaster movie didn't start until a little later. So instead of me being stuck in there waiting and waiting for a, a few good hours to started, um, my mum insisted I go in there with her to watch this shit film, um, and then a few years later. I tell my cousins, I'm sat there and I'm watching Mam and I put Mamma Mia on and I thought, wow, this movie isn't that bad. And I actually fell in love with it. So yeah, I like this film a lot actually, great film. From 2008. And then 10 years later we got the sequel. Really enjoyed this movie a lot. I loved this film, loved this more than the first one actually. It's got some good songs in this. Um, yeah, I like that film a lot. Mamma Mia. Next we have Meet Me in St. Louis from 1944 with uh, Judy Garland, of course. Great film. Up next we have Oliver, a classic from 1968 with, um, this is 68? Yeah. Um, 1968, great film, Oliver. Um, Ron Moody, um, Oliver Reed, Harry C. Combe, Shani Wallace, Mark Lester, and Jack Wilde. Jack Wilde sadly died young. Um, the only actors who are alive now in the Oliver universe 
are um, Mark Lester and Shaney Wallace. So those those are the only ones that are still alive. Ron Moody sadly died a few years ago. He did all right though. He was in his nineties. Next we have um, School of Rock, a great film from uh, 2003. I think the film that made Jack Black into a good star. I like Jack Black, he's a great actor. And I liked him a lot in this film and I liked him in other films as well. So I would say I'm a huge... I like Jack, I like Jack Black. So, yeah, great film, of course. Next, we have my all-time favourite musical, and uh, Seven Brides and Seven Brothers, with Harold Keel and uh, Jane Powell, who for some reason I thought was still alive, but she sadly passed away a few years ago, and I didn't even know. I thought, oh, I thought she was still alive, but nah, she died in 2016, I think. Um, yeah, I like this film a lot, well, my all-time favourite musical. I can remember pretty much every single line from this movie. Um, Alright, you're going to act like hogs, you can eat like hogs. I like that film a lot. Uh, care for the children, Rebecca? I uh, like that film a lot. Next, you have Singing in the Rain, of course, classic with Gene, well Gene, Gene Kelly, Donald O'Connor and Debbie Reynolds for 1952. Great film. It's uh, 70 years old now. Ooh. And last but not least, for musicals, we have The Sound of Music from 1965 with Julie Andrews and Christopher Plummer. Uh, may he rest in peace. I really enjoyed this movie a lot. And that is my music section. So, that's the musicals out of the way. So up next will be my uh, sort of mystery slash romance section. So um, yeah, my mystery section's small, but I do have a couple of romance movies to show off. So anyway, thanks for watching and see you soon. Ta-ra.